in the heart of the word. Reflections by Father Joseph Mary, SCTJM, on the daily readings from the Holy Mass, 12th day of Christmas, the beauty of friendship in Christ. God bless you, dear family. Today in the heart of the word, we meet Philip and Nathaniel. Philip was from Bethsaida, the town of Andrew and Peter. When Philip meets Jesus, he runs to tell his best friend, Nathaniel. And Philip tells Nathaniel, we have found the one that Moses wrote about in the law, Jesus, the son of Joseph from Nazareth. When Jesus meets Nathaniel, he tells him, before Philip called you, I saw you under the fig tree. Philip has shared with Nathaniel the greatest gift he had, his relationship with Jesus. And Jesus, quoting the prophet Micah, tells him that he sees his heart, that he knows him, and that even in the darkest moments of his life, Jesus has always been with him. In fact, at the Last Supper, Jesus will tell both of them, I call you friends. And there's no greater love than to lay down your life for your friends. Today, one year ago, the funeral mass was offered for the eternal rest of our beloved Pope Benedict XVI. And Pope Benedict's inaugural homily a successor of Peter, he preached, there is nothing more beautiful than to be surprised by the gospel, by the encounter with Christ. There is nothing more beautiful than to know him and to speak to others of our friendship with him. My brothers and sisters, like Nathaniel, like Philip, let us speak of Christ to someone today and let them know of our friendship with him. Let us listen to these words of Mother Adela. The gentle heart of a lamb was the name I gave to Pope Benedict XVI. Docile, firm, gentle, and meek, a lamb slaughtered in many ways, we are to be so grateful for the gift that he has been for the church and for each one of us. Thank you, Lord, for the gift of Benedict XVI, and thank you, Pope Benedict, for laying down your life for your friends, for there is no greater love than that. All for the heart of Jesus, through the heart of Mary.